Hey, good morning. Uh, this is Gospel Girl, also known as Peace Paint. Um, I just wanted to, to say a few things about what's going on in our country and all of the, the chaos with the caravan and all that. I hope you all know, those of you who have been awakened, know that this is the enemy's plan. Uh, it, it This is not just some random thing. And I just looked on the forecast and there is a hurricane headed their way. I find that uh, pretty amazing. And also, I wanted to encourage you today to not listen to every prophecy that is eternal doom. Um, there are some out there, uh, I think it's the Prophecy Club that said that we're going to be invaded by some countries, small countries at that. Um, I believe that is a lie. Uh, that does not, I mean, I really prayed about to God about this. I believe that's a lie. And I want to share a dream with you. On my last video, I told you about the dream of Diane Feinstein. This dream was a dream of... Uh, someone told me to go look for a man. And I went. And this house that I went to was old. It hadn't been touched up. It hasn't been uh, like the ch like the pit. Like It was like an old farmhouse. The, the paint was chipping and, and all that. And um, I looked in the backyard, and in the backyard there was a huge horse trailer. And the first thing I noticed was there was a dead horse in the horse trailer. And then along the side of the horse trailer, uh, there was a, a horse that was laying on his side. And he was dying. He was going to die at any moment. He was gasping for air. And then, for some reason, the Lord took me off to the other side of the home, and I saw another horse, but this horse was still standing and was tied up, but he was getting sick. And then I went into the house, and I looked around at all the things in the home, and they were old. They were um, not useful anymore. I guess you could say. And then I looked for this person that they wanted me to look for. I don't know who he was. And I don't know who the person was that sent me. And I know that this man was dead. When I found him, he was dead. And he was old. Now, these are the things of the world that I looked at. The things that man trusts in that I looked at. And what I got from this dream and what I feel in my spirit is that we are not to look for man for answers. We are to look at the Most High for answers. It is Jesus who will give us our answers. It is the Holy Spirit who will give us peace. And then also, all last week, and still to this day, when I go into the spirit and I when I go into prayer, I'm not going straight into prayer. I'm busting out into song. I am singing. And I cannot stretch this far. I don't know how to get this around quick enough. But I know that we are to sing like King Jehoshaphat did. I had a dream one time where, and the Lord brought this back to me like I had it yesterday, where the enemy was standing in front of me and some other people. And we began to sing. And the Lord sent his angels before us and fought the enemy, and we won. And I believe the Lord reminded me of this dream because this is what we are to do in this time. We are we are winning, and it is God's miracles. We are seeing miracles like you wouldn't believe. The Kavanaugh here, um, the caravan. We're going to see a miracle there. Um, we're going to see a miracle in the midterms. These are miracles. Um, you know, you can believe me if you want. 
and if you don't, you don't. You know, I'm just, I'm just a messenger here. And I think that the Lord really just wants us, we've already asked for God to restore our country. Now we are now to break forth into song. You only need to ask God one time. God has heard us. He is trying to heal our land. Now let's break forth in song and give him all our holy praises unto him which was due. We can't fathom his ways. We never will. And I just know that I know that I know that I know it is time to sing to God. It is time to break forth into song. If you don't know the story of King Jehoshaphat, I'll break it down real quick. He was, he's the king of Israel. He goes before the Lord because he's getting ready to go to war. He is outnumbered greatly by the enemy. And the Lord tells him to put a choir before his army, before the infantry. So he does this. And the enemy ends up turning on each other and killing each other. Now, come on, church. God has given us everything, every answer we need in the Word of God. So let's do this. I'm singing, and it's time for you to sing. If you like this video, if you like what I had to say, give me a thumbs up. I'm trying to get this out there as quick as I can. Today I'm going to put this on Instagram. I've noticed peace paint on, on Instagram. Uh, Get this out there. The Lord, I, I wanted to do makeup videos and makeup tutorials. Well, the Lord had a different plan for me. And this is it. And I would rather do this. If I can get one soul saved, Jesus is real. He is the Son of God. And it's never, it's not too late right now. So if you don't know the Lord Jesus, it's very simple. You ask him into your heart. And then you need to ask for the Holy Spirit. You need to ask for discernment. We must be baptized in water and fire to enter the gates of heaven. It is in the word of God. Are you baptized in fire? That is also very important. And seek the Holy Spirit of truth. There is a counterfeit. The devil has a counterfeit for everything. So, anyway, I'm going to get off here. Uh, excuse the mess. Uh, Grandpa's old sweater. Love it. I'm not going to get rid of it. <laughs> I just love it. It's ugly brown. But, anyway, God be with you. God have mercy upon you and have favor on you. I pray for peace in Israel. And I plead the blood of Jesus over this video. In Jesus' name, amen. Have a great day. He was here yesterday too, eating on the same flower.